Part 3 of the Bluetooth Basics series will show you how to troubleshoot Bluetooth issues on a Mac. Apple has been supporting Bluetooth much longer than the PC world, so the drivers are generally not a factor in troubleshooting Bluetooth issues. The main thing to remember when pairing third-party, non-Apple wireless devices on a Mac is to make sure that the device is already in pairing mode before you have your Mac start searching for it. If the device is already in pairing mode, the Mac will find it immediately. If the device is not in pairing mode, finding the device on your Mac will be hit or miss. Next, we'll outline some other areas to look at if your Bluetooth device is still not functioning properly. First, check your system preferences, Bluetooth, Advanced, and make sure Allow Bluetooth Devices to Wake Up This Computer is checked. If you're seeing connectivity issues with Bluetooth devices after checking the settings we've already covered, there are several steps to reset your system's wireless abilities. One is an SMC reset, and the other is a PRAM reset. These are most commonly needed if you have upgraded from an earlier OS X version, such as Mavericks, to Yosemite. In order to reset the SMC on portable devices with built-in batteries, first shut down the computer. Next, plug in the MagSafe power adapter to a power source, connecting it to the Mac if it's not already connected. Then, on the built-in keyboard, press the left side shift control option keys and the power button at the same time. Then, release all the keys and the power button at the same time. Lastly, press the power button to turn on the computer. If the SMC reset steps do not resolve the problem, you can also try resetting the PRAM, but please note that it may cause some of your custom settings to be reset, such as time, volume, mouse settings, and keyboard preferences, so it should only be used after having exhausted all other options. In order to reset the PRAM, first, shut down the computer, press the power button, and before the gray screen appears, press the command, option, P and R keys at the same time. Hold the keys until your computer restarts and you hear the startup sound a second time. Now release the keys. Please note that pre-Mavericks OS X, you need to ensure that you have added the Bluetooth device to Favorites. Select the device name in the Devices section of the Bluetooth System Preferences and click the Add to Favorites button, which is available under the cogwheel looking icon. A red hearted shape icon will appear in the device's listing. If these steps aren't taken, the keyboard will disconnect after sleep mode and won't reconnect without a system restart. This setting is no longer required from Mavericks OS X 10.9.2 and later. This concludes the Bluetooth Basics series. Thank you for watching.